Hi everyone, very excited to be home for a change. I'm making a quick Chinese stir fry, but this time I'm using some new sauces and whatever vegetables are lying in the fridge. So stay tuned for this new recipe on If Night Can Cook. Review of the general ingredients: some sauces, 500 grams of boneless chicken thigh breast, and a tablespoon of corn flour, one teaspoon sugar, black pepper, salt, red chili flakes, sesame seeds. Use your hands to mix this well. If it's too dry, add some water. Fry in a pan like this. Fry half pieces at a time. Remove. Fry the rest. I've removed that. Now adding a tablespoon of chopped garlic, tablespoon of chopped ginger, half a cup of chopped and diced onions. I have dried bird's eye chili you may use fresh. And now some chopped celery. I'm going to add one large sliced carrot, one onion, one capsicum chopped. Stir this for just two minutes. Don't want the carrots and onions getting soft. Add the chicken rice packet. And now mix this and let's prepare the sauce. Using the same bowl, this is one tablespoon corn flour, one tablespoon dark soy sauce for color. If you don't have it, use extra soy sauce. One tablespoon of the vinegar. One tablespoon soy sauce, one tablespoon sesame oil, two tablespoon black bean sauce, cup water, mix this well. I added a teaspoon sugar and I'm going to mix it into the chicken. Just let this boil once, turn off the fire as soon as that happens because this is cooked. This is ready. I'm just garnishing this with some green chilies and some celery leaves. And I'm serving this with sticky jasmine rice. I hope you guys enjoyed this recipe. I'm back to make more on If Night Can Cook. Let me know what you think. Okay, this uh, is smelling really good. I love jasmine rice. Try and get uh, jasmine rice, guys. It's better than basmati for this kind of food. It's so good. I hope you're going to make this. I'm very excited about this recipe. And I'm looking forward to feedback from you. I hope you guys enjoyed this recipe. I really enjoyed eating it. And uh, trust me, it is really good and very, very easy to make. So make it soon and let me know what you think on If I Can Cook.